Hi, I'm Britta Eske from Core, and um, my husband Lee and I are preparing this week for a course that we're teaching next week, an eight-week course that's called the Brave Heart, and it's a compassion cultivation training. So we thought we would share some tools and practices for you around compassion for this next week. The first one being today is about recognizing suffering. I find that really poignant right now because aren't we all asked to recognize suffering at this moment in time? Here in America, it's specifically about the recognition of the suffering of the black people, of any people of color that have been oppressed, discriminated against, just because of the color of their skin. And there is a cry that wants to be heard about this. That's what I see when I see, I was just at a protest and when I see, when I see those images uh, on TV and on Facebook, it just, I just see people crying, hear me. I am suffering, we are suffering. And we are asked, and the movement of compassion is to lean into that, to recognize that versus what our egoic response is, which is always to turn away from it and to numb out or get overwhelmed or not be able to deal with it. So that's why we call this course the brave heart. The brave heart stays open and available and sees it, sees external suffering, sees internal suffering, my own recognizes my own suffering. So there might be suffering that you're experiencing as a response to this, you know, like helplessness, shame, guilt, sadness, anger. Um, there's people affected by the riots that are affected by the violence of these riots, which that causes suffering. And so there's just suffering all around that we're asked to, to not turn away from but lean into. And that of course is happening on top of a pandemic <laughs> where we've had so much suffering in the last two months of financial concerns and health concerns and healthcare workers on the front lines fearing for their life. And all this is also still happening. So, and suffering really has always happened that's part of life, that actually is something that connects all us humans. We all know about pain. We all know about suffering and we all have the tendency to turn away from it, to not want to feel it. So our tool for you for today is to recognize it without defending against it, to keep your heart open, to let it lean in, to let it be, to, to um, recognize it. Yeah, to recognize it. So as you're going, watching TV or um, going through Facebook and see all these comments and all these feelings from everyone, recognize the suffering, the cry, and, and then recognize what's going on for you and recognize your own suffering. There will be more, more videos coming, so thank you.